first of all. Hi. Hey guys, it's me. It's a cupcake G and all of my stressed out glory. Don't mind me, hello, yes. Today, I'm making a video because well that's clear obviously because what else would you be fucking watching but i'm here today i made a video because i went for a walk earlier and i went to sally's first of all because i needed a couple of things in my life <laughs> still need a couple of things in my life but i came across this little thing right here it says it's a silicone sponge and it says it absorbs no product so you can use less foundation and i was looking at it kind of funny at first because i'm just sitting here like how is that gonna blend into my skin? I don't know. Cause you know me, like every other bitch in the world, I use a beauty blender. So. I just said you know me like we actually friends. None of y'all even ever met me. I'm sorry, excuse me. Anyway, today we're gonna be doing a kind of get ready with me ish, test this ish out versus this ish type of shit because I have a callback to go to and I gotta get ready. But I wanna make a video trying out this silicone sponge so that's what we're gonna do today so i'm gonna go i'm gonna do these brows i'm gonna attempt to do something with these edges because lord knows they need a little bit of they need a little bit of father son and holy ghost so i'm gonna do that and i'll be back eyebrows and I laid down my edges to the best of my abilities although I don't really think they're gonna stay in place cuz I do not by any means have any fancy hair products I'm literally just using this bullshit from Walmart but that's okay that's okay we don't need to impress nobody today so I'm going to go in with actually okay I'm probably not the only one who does this but I mix my foundations depending on how I'm trying to look so today I'm just trying to like do like a natural enhancement of my face if that makes sense you know what I mean just enhancing the beautiness that you already have okay bitch so you know what the fuck I'm talking about I don't need to over explain myself to you all right so I'm gonna go in with this Becca foundation I have it in the color what color I got I got mahogany and I kind of, I'm not going to go with Fenty today. I'm just going to go in with this number seven perfect that I got from Walgreens. I don't see a shade. No, I don't see a shade. It's just, I just use these as my go-to every day. So I'm going to take the sponge that I've seemed to already have lost. Oh, here it is. <laughs> All right. So as I said, this is just the face secrets professional. It actually says professional like professional silicone sponge so i'm gonna open it i'm gonna feel it i'm not gonna lie i'm kind of scared oh 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 jesus all right it feels i don't know i don't know how to feel about it like the back the directions literally say apply product directly to sponge and blot on face Clean with soap and warm water after each use and let <laughs> I wonder who that is. But, um, no, alright. So I guess I'm gonna... Actually, before... Before any of that, I'm gonna wipe off my face with some water. Cause... Honestly, I'm gonna be honest with y'all. I probably still got some makeup on from yesterday because I'm a lazy hoe. So, I'm just gonna lightly blotting my face i'm gonna take off my glasses because i'm about to put on makeup who the fuck needs glasses right now 
So I got them kids down there destroying each other, but I really don't give a goddamn. Um, Alright. I'm not going to do my forehead because that's at the end. When? At the end? This is going to stay on for a minute. It's probably going to stay on until I leave. So I'm probably just going to leave my forehead alone until I leave. But I'm going to take this little bullshit primer that I have. I'm calling everything bullshit. I'm sorry. No offense to none of these brands. I'm just like, just saying bullshit because it's not like fancy shit like everybody else has on the internet. Like everybody got fancy, MAC all this shit and i just got walgreens like this is just some hard candy mattifying primer i'm just gonna take a little bit because i get oily and this seems to work pretty goddamn well like i got it i want to say like me two weeks ago and it works pretty well for what i be trying to do i get a nice amount of little compliments it looks a little bit better already all right and i already wet my sponge I'm trying to decide which one i want to do first I want to do the gel silicone. I'm going to do the silicone on do silicone on this side. And I'm going to do my beauty blender on this side. So, they say apply it. <sighs> God damn it. They say just apply it, like, to here. And I'm only doing, like, one half of my face. So, I'm just going to take a little bit of the back here. A little bit of the number seven. It's not coming out yet. Don't come for me. And it says just blot it on your face. Like, I'm... I'm honestly scared for this next part. How do you blot with a... <laughs> okay. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm gonna cry. Oh my Jesus. <laughs> this, am I doing it right, Mom? I gotta get this. <laughs> it looks like I'm putting on my makeup with a chicken cutlet. Oh my goodness. I don't know how to feel about this. Let's see if I can. No, okay. Oh my god. <laughs> I don't like it. I feel like I'm about to cry. <laughs> I, I don't know. In all honesty, I'm probably gonna need to redo it. This is as good as it's gonna get. I mean, cause I don't see no improvement. Nothing's getting any better. Like, do y'all see the difference? <laughs> this is what it looks like after. <laughs> like, I don't know, bitch. That still looks like some product to me, but <laughs> it's okay, I guess. All right, so now I'm gonna go in with the. <laughs> I'm gonna go into Beauty Blender. I'll put a little bit of Bex, a little bit of Numbs, and I'm gonna, like, I don't know, the Beauty Blender, it may take product or whatever, but it blends it into my face, at least, like, I washed Y'all wouldn't believe how often I wash this head scarf. Actually, you probably would believe. See all the abuse this thing is going through. All right. I don't know. Where am I looking? Like I'm looking at the screen of my phone instead of looking at you guys. I'm sorry. Um. I. I don't know. I don't, <laughs> like they could look the same, but for me, it just feels like this side is just slightly more blended. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know how to feel. I don't know how to think. But I'm gonna finish the video. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do my whole face like I normally do. And since this says like it's mostly used for just like liquids, like foundation and shit, like cream, blushes, and all of that bullshit, I'm gonna use my beauty blender to set my shit. And I just used this loose setting powder from Black Radiance. I've had, okay, I've had this CoverGirl Translucent Professional Powder since like as long as I can remember. Like I was probably 
a, a sophomore in high school type shit and i'm almost out and in my recent move y'all probably already saw the video probably not but if you haven't go check it out um i couldn't find my makeup bag like it was lost in the truck somewhere in oblivion out in the nether realms type shit so i went to walmart with my cousin and i got i got this and honestly this works a little bit better i'm kind of impressed by it actually like i get banana powder vibes from it i don't know if i'm using that term right but my mother had banana powder and this reminds me of it because it has like a nice little yellow tone to it and i don't really ever put a lot just enough to set my shit like to where i know it won't come off you feel me these children are like destroying each other downstairs like no bullshit yeah y'all probably believe how much i watched this huh no i'm going to go in with something else that i got not big brand at all just another little black radiance medium to dark this is actually a contour palette but i don't have any what's it called press powder for myself in my shade because i had becca press powder but like when i was just hitting pan i had some bad luck right before i moved and i dropped that bitch so it broke and you know once it breaks it's in oblivion so i just used the darkest color right here because i'm a pretty i'm a pretty chocolate bitch and I just use that where I didn't use the powder. You know, you want to know something? I've recorded like two get ready with me videos. This is the first one I actually uploaded if it makes it to the YouTubes. But I don't know. I've been feeling pretty motivated lately. Like, I got like five, not, let me, uh, <clears throat> let me not lie, like three videos. Recorded on my phone. I just never upload them. I don't know why. I'm like, maybe I'm just, maybe I'm just chicken. Alright, so then I go with this little brow profusion, profusion cosmetics. Yeah, that's the thing. And I, I, just use this little fan brush. And I go into the chocolate, kind of between the chocolate and the soft browns right here. And I use those as my contour. A wise woman once said, who needs nostrils? Was it nostrils? Yes, she said, who needs nostrils? If the men found out we can change the bones in our face by just contouring, we're finished. That wise woman was Sailor J. But instead of no nostrils, you know what I say? Who needs a jaw? Okay, get rid of that shit. We don't need that shit. We don't need no jaw. Just get rid of that bitch. Take that bitch out. You don't need that hoe. You don't need her and her negative energies in your life, okay? I'm just gonna go in. I'm just gonna destroy that, y'all. Just get rid of it. Beautiful! Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Let's see if I can do eyeliner on camera. Ooh. But I'm gonna be looking at the screen, so if y'all wanna make eye contact with me, I'm so fucking sorry. I guess I should text back. recording a video. Okay. Um... Shut up. Okay. Um, fuck, why can't I open this? Haha. -ha. Use the shirt. Use the shirt. Hands too slippery? Use the shirt. All right. So, I don't know what the fuck this is. It's like Natural Plus Liquid Eyeliner Black. My cousin said she got it from a beauty supply store and she thought it was mascara. So, I was like, oh, well, I'll need eyeliner. So, um, I passed it this way, bitch. I feel like I won't be able to do this. Who has faith in me? Raise your hand if you have faith in me. You know what? No eyeliner today. That's just go, what's, what it's gonna have to be. Cause I don't have time <laughs> to worry about why this shit, why it's not going right today, okay? I don't know, okay, I ain't got time to figure it out. But we're gonna continue nonetheless because I'm almost done and it's showtime, bitch. So take this Maybelline, actually wait. I'm getting way ahead of myself. I actually got something else. And then mascara because I'm running out. And I ain't got that much. So I just got a little Lush Plump. Lush Plump? What does it say? Lush Lash. Yeah. Oh, plumping mascara. Okay. I feel you. Ooh, this is a juicy one. Is that probably whoever? You know, pop the most shit. The bitches are shit out again. I don't know. I've used better mascaras. 
And I'm not gonna get super critical because it is just a little Sally's brand mascara. And if you're still watching at this point in the video, you the real MVP. I just want you to know, I appreciate you. <laughs> Cause Lord knows this is by no means an entertaining video, but hey, thank you for being you and watching my video. I don't know, like as I go on, like the sides are really starting to look more and more just like the same. Am I crazy? Or are y'all noticing that song? Ooh, got another text message. Just send some emojis. Well, you don't know what to say, just send emojis. Gotta work all that all that. Work all of that shit out. Alright, now I like the glow. At least on my nose. So I'm gonna go and with another little little little, little drugstore brand. It's L'Oreal Lumi Glow Nudes. I'm gonna take this one and this one. Just put it right here. Cause I like to look like a glow version of Rudolph. You feel me? They had this little um wet and wild eyeshadow palette that I used to use. It has some really nice little glitters in it and shit. But in the move it got dropped and all the glitters broke. So that's that <laughs> but yeah just like a little bit of glow on my nose ain't nothing wrong with that i didn't contour my nose today that's weird i usually contour my nose no i don't let me stop lying mm -hmm. i'd rather be with you than i am with you okay look at me almost done i want to put on lipstick and um lip gloss but i don't need to leave for like another hour or so and i don't want it to just get all crusty and shit so i feel like final verdict for these for these for this <laughs> for this thing i can't find why is this whole hiding from me like i don't, <laughs> I don't understand wow underneath my face towel I don't know, but I feel like the final little verdict for this, excuse me, sir, for this <laughs> silicone sponge, squishy chicken cutlet thing, uh, I think it did pretty well. Like it, they look pretty much basically the same. This will always be my old reliable, but at least now I know, hey, I got a silicone sponge if I'm ever low on product and I still need to look good. You know what I mean? So I approve, I approve, I think it's cool. It's fun to hold, you know what I'm saying? It's squishy. Boom. Just never used it, scared, hold my breath. Nope. Oh, oh, got spillage. Get rid of it. <laughs> Get rid of it. Get rid of it. Get rid of it. Okay. I'm gonna go in with Here it is. Okay. Found it. I'm gonna go in with this Maybelline Superstay Matte Ink Liquid Lipstick because I love liquid lipsticks. <laughs> I don't even know how I wasn't recording. But I am now. And um, basically all I said was went in with this, this Maybelline Superstay ink. And I just used a little bit of black to darken it up around the edges. And then I just went in with this little basic lip gloss right here. That's it. Crazy, right? All right, guys, thank you for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed watching me slap a chicken cutlet on my face. Um, I think in the end, it actually, it was, hmm, hi, hmm. Can't judge a book by its cover, that's all I gotta say. As you can see, like both sides, they look relatively the same. This one might even be like just a little bit smoother. I don't, 
uh, my eyes may be playing tricks on me but um it looks pretty damn good to me so one for chicken cutlet zero for tootie so thank you guys for watching if you enjoyed please subscribe and leave a like on this video if you enjoy seeing my face and all of its weird glory and i'll talk to you guys next time bye yeah fake as hell you always wonder if you walk out of here with these eyebrows looking all type of crazy